All right, we got day two going on. Man, oh man. Day one wasn't the worst, wasn't the best. We are going to evolve. We're going to adapt. So I'm not feeling the greatest. My nose all stuffed up. So if I sound a little different, yeah. And sorry about the late video. This is a hard one game of betting. The other one, you know, we got so much to talk about. So little time. All right, let's get right into it. If you're new, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. If you want to get all my other bets, get it all of them first directly to your phone, get the slips, all that stuff. Become a Hall of Famer. It's only $25 a month. You access to all of it. If you wonder how I do all my research will help me out, I use Outlier. Test them out for free for a week. All you have to do is click the link in the bio. Yo. All right. So let's recap yesterday. Yesterday. Ooh, good thing I stayed away from Var. So yesterday we ended up losing a unit and a half, hundred and fifty-two dollars for me. Still have us over forty-one units for the season, and the one we hit was Draymond Green to hit a three, clutch twenty-five dollars got us four hundred. When you look at most of the bets. Most of them I like and I stand by because like um, Lakers to win, D'Lo double-double. He had six assists in the first half, second half zero. Four more assists, that would have put us like extra $500. Bunch of good bets. If Warriors didn't get completely destroyed, Clay Thompson have the same many points as me and you. Would have made some more money, so could have been better, could have been worse. Let's get right in to it. So, the first game is the best game. Now, I know a lot of people is worried about Joel Embiid. I'm not too much worried about him because I'm certain he's going to play. Only thing I hate, watch this game. Joel Embiid with important games, what he do is fall on the ground for no apparent reason. He would just be walking and he just going to fall on the ground. Somebody touch him, that's my size. He's going to fall on the ground. It's like, bro, you're the biggest person on the court. Keep your big ass from off the ground. That's what y'all going to notice. Our game is going to piss you off since I said it. Stay healthy. The game, you know. All right. Before I even show y'all the bets, bets that I very much like without them doing for four units, these are game changers right here. So these are $100 bets for me. Tyrese Maxey over on rebounds his rebounds over under is at four his last three games versus miami six rebounds eight rebounds nine rebounds whatever it is maxi grab rebounds against them and the only other time this year is three so out of the four games he only didn't cover one time so this is a game changer there's no way you shouldn't take this for a full unit just you know, that's what you got to do. Another one is his assists. You look at his assists head-to-head -head the last three games. Five assists, seven assists, ten assists, and 11 assists. I'm just showing y'all what it is. His over-under is, is it six and a half or I got it at five and a half? I think I got it at five and a half for some reason. Let me see. Or I don't know. One of the two. But I like his over on that also for a full unit. Cali Oubre. Look at his. His, not his points, his rebounds. And you look at all of these games playing against them. Like he played a lot of games. Oh, and I'm looking at the wrong darn thing. There we go. <laughs> yeah, he played a lot of games against Miami. Four games. And like, good thing with. This game, you have enough data to really make a lot of money. It's just, I don't, you know, I can do like 30, 40 bets and probably win about five grand. So I'll probably do a lot more bets in the Patreon because, you know, doing on a video is just, it's hard to, to do. But look at this, seven rebounds, 11 rebounds, eight rebounds, and three right here. So I like his rebounds over five too. So those are 
the ones I absolutely love. Randomly, Joa and B don't really score 30 points over them. Last year, couldn't get 30, got 27. This year, well, I mean, last year again, 21. This year, 29. So, with Eric Spolstra, the way he play in B must be smart. So, he could go off, but just think of those and have that in your mind. So, the first thing I did, $14 for 500 Jimmy Butler, under on points. Kelly Oubre, over on points. Maxi over on points. Joe Embiid, under. Kyle Lowry, over. Just hit two threes, Kyle Lowry. And Tyler Hero, over on the points. We got to see how Hero going to show up. We got to see how Embiid would be. I really ain't worried about him too much. And you got to worry. You got to see how if Butler, because it ain't technically playoff, so we don't know if Butler going to be playoff Jimmy or who, who, emo Jimmy. We don't know who he going to be. But that's one. Next, we got the rebounds. Ubre, y'all know I got us over. Hero over. Joe and Beeb under. Maxi over. Tobias Harris under. He's going to be real close. He probably get right at six and, and scare us um, for the game. And Bam out of IO over. And when you look at these, this is very easy. This is why you want something like um, Outlier because look at this. You can just look at the consistency. So that's why, like, a lot of my bets be close or if it don't hit, don't use a hit by one because I like to go head-to-head -head and look at the last four games he played against them. And this is all this season, 15, 13, 13, 11. Going down, so it could be at 10. We see. But I like that. And if that's $17, get you 500 Next with the assist, Joe B under. Tobias Harris under, Hero over, Bam over, Jimmy Butler over, and uh, Maxi over. Thirteen dollars to get you five hundo. Now, obviously, this should be in B with no problems. But with the games yesterday, like the first game you had Zion, and the second game you had the third option, you had Murray had the had the most points. So. I'm going with, like, the easy option. You ain't going to really, really win no money. So let's see if Hero can be the hero and go crazy. $10 gets you 100 Kelly Oubre, go crazy. $10 gets you a thou wow. I can see Oubre starting off hot. So that would be a great play. I like that. They didn't get a blowout. So they can, well, I guess, not rest players. But you know how that go. Um, uh, Will there be an overtime? I like this as an overtime bet. First overtime bet of this season because... When you look at them, no team has won by over seven points and they played a million times. Play with and beat, without and beat, and they play without and beat majority of the times. But look at this. First time they played, six points by the Heat. Second time, five points by the Heat. Seven points by the 76ers, four points by 76ers. And B only played this game that last game. So this... Should be a close game. It should be a competitive game. Probably low scoring. A lot of defense. But money's to be made and could be overtime. Joe Embiid, 40 points. Why not? Like, we know Embiid can have 20 in the first quarter. So, do that. And we got Embiid only slip. So, here you go, Embiid. We got you 30, 10, and 6. 30, 10, and 6. Really easy to do. Bam, 28. Get you 100. I really do this to really be like even numbers where it's like hundred dollars even two dollars two hundred dollars even so that's why it always look a little weird this game i i didn't even know trey young was back playing until the chat told me today so i just realized i'm leaving this game the hell alone so this i already cooked this one up <laughs> before i got to trey young i'm like y'all what trey young doing playing so we're going um uh, bodon over demar Derozan under which is interesting i was laughing with them showing them when you look at DeRozan, like, that's why I love looking at um, charts. It look hilarious sometimes. And, like, look at this. You see how it go 34, 28, 26, 21. So it went straight right there. Then went right back up. 21, 25, 29, 31. So the question is, is it going to peak one more? Or is it going to start going back down? So it's interesting. I think 30 points is too high, even though he could go hard 
and dominate because he's been very consistent and clutch lately. 30, 34, 39. Like, he's been on one. He's been on one. But I like his under. I like his under. Um, Ayo, we got his over. Murray under. Murray is terrible against him for some reason. Clint, we got his uh, over on points. Vucevic under and Trey Young. No way I'm taking Trey Young over with him not playing no serious games really lately. 891 get your foul, Hundo. Top scores over here. We're going to do Kobe White and we'll do Bogan. So we got nine to get you 200, 11 to get you 100. Really, this should be DeMar DeRozan. Uh, I really, I see DeMar DeRozan really should be the one getting it. Now, FanDuel gave us a 30% boost. This is what I came up with. AO 10 points, Clint 10, Bodon 15, Vucevic 15, Hero 15, Maxi 20, Oubre 10, three rebounds, um, Nicola two rebounds, and Butler four. A hundred dollars get you over eleven a hundo. Ten a unit you could. This is you can do this up to two units, two hundred. But you know, I wasn't doing that. Get my money spread it elsewhere. Joe M B first basket made. And you just gotta play it all the way, all the way around. Hell, he can shoot a three, he can do whatever it is, free throw. I don't care. We gonna make a hundred dollars anyway, as long as he score. So this is how I did it. We got dunk, free throw, layup. Other and three pointer. Now you could have did for more, but you don't know like who's going to score first. So never know. I love this one. You have Philadelphia trail by fifteen or Miami Heat field, um trail by fifteen, and somebody come back and win. Boom, get you a hundred dollars even. No sweat with DraftKings. I did Maxi. Like mind you, if Maxi don't. And Uber don't get this. It's going to mess up a lot of slips, but I'm okay with that because I like the math with it. It's just a good play. If it don't hit, then, yeah, I'm just going to stand on it. But I do like it. Maxi and Uber both over on rebounds and Maxi over on assists. No sweat. $5 gets you one eleven. This one, I was going to do a full unit to take um, Joel and B points over in the first quarter, but they gave us a gift of. Butler and Embiid over 15 points in the first quarter. Easy money. Cash at $25. Max you can do 50. Take that money. And these are my unit plays I did. Ubre over on rebounds. Maxi over on rebounds. Maxi over on assists. Uh, Maxi out, baby. 713. Get you over a while. We need Duncan Robinson and four threes. Tyrese Maxi, eight rebounds. We got Maxi. On assist 10, Ubre 8 rebounds, Caruso, bam, 13. Posa got me a thousand and tied submit and they freaking changed the odds. So it that really like pissed me off. <laughs> so next you got uh DeMar DeRozan, just in case he go crazy. 40 points. And just in case Trey Young decides to actually shoot and go crazy, gotta have him on there and then MB. So you want a crazy one in there just in case the craziness end up happening so ladies and gents players and pimps sorry about the late video you can switch some bets around however you want to y'all know my thing i'm gonna stay by it stand with it it is what it is i like it. you can also do one to fade maxi and Ubre just for like some insurance just in case they don't come through so yeah do that fade them on a rebounds assist all of it just in case to cover your tail let's get it let's make some money and i'm gone